At Ganoff, a public forum has been held by the Municipal Assembly to outline its medium-term development plan for the municipality. The town hall meeting was instituted by the Assembly as an avenue for residents within the Ganoff Township and its surrounding communities to take stock of the past and to take decisions on the future direction of the community. The Member of Parliament of Trobu Constituency, Mr. Moses Enim indicated that decentralization is a way to speed up development and that was the motive behind the creation of Ghan North Municipality, which was carved out of Ghan West Municipality or Amasama. He added that the municipality is new and faced with lots of challenges. The municipality has less than 20% of the road start. The assembly is initiating several projects within the municipality and key among them is the upgrade of eight road networks within the municipality captured in the 2018 budget review. My little advice to all of us is to hold the of as our own, our own baby, and make the critical inputs and show concern and let us all develop this municipality within one year should be one of the first top class municipality in Ghana. The Municipal Chief Executive for Ghana North, Mrs. Gladys Ankara, said the government's flagship One District, One Factory program, Free SHS, among others, are all meant to create more jobs for the teaming unemployed youth in the district and improve the living standards of the residents. The President has initiated numerous interventions which we are to take advantage of to move when the government agenda of the government to advance our cause. In view of this, the Assembly has met the various stakeholders at the zonal level and solicited residents' views toward the preparation of Medium Term Development Plan MTDP 2018 to 2021. In line with this framework, the municipality has adapted four out of the five national goals build prosperous society, create opportunities for all, safeguard the national environment, maintain stable, united, and safe society, and strengthening Ghana's roles in international affairs. She said the assembly is making moves to provide street light to the various communities to ward off criminals who operate at night. The residents were encouraged to take advantage of town hall meetings to voice out their grievances. Then the gene took turns to probe into the progress of development in the area. The residents were hopeful that their contributions would help the development of the young assembly. This is Regional Diary, your window to the regions. We'll be right back. Please stay on.